So much. A show of support tonight for Chicago first responder Timothy Island. A Chicago firefighter was off duty when he was shot last month. Days ago, he spoke for the first time since. Tonight, the Black Fire Brigade hosted a fundraiser for his family. If your house is on fire and your family members are in need, Tim's the guy who's going in to get them. Stephen Ellerson Jr. is talking about his co-worker and friend, Chicago firefighter Timothy Island. He saved property and lives over the years, and now he's fighting for his own after being shot in the face. He's began to, um, as I'm sure you've heard, speak more uh, in recent days. Um, he's been up for six, seven hours at a time on a daily basis, so he's, he's coming around more and he's, he's more responsive. So we're, we're extremely optimistic that he'll have a, a full recovery. This was a fundraiser hosted by the Black Fire Brigade for the 32-year-old firefighter. Island was off duty, leaving a surprise birthday party on September 11th when someone drove by shooting in the 300 block of East Kensington in West Pullman. His 15-year-old niece was also shot. She's home recovering. Island is eating through a feeding tube, can't walk on his own, but did speak earlier this week. It just doesn't make sense what's, what's happening in our city. This gun violence is just really bad. Island has a long road to recovery. His parents started this GoFundMe to help with medical expenses. The husband and father of five is the sole provider for his family. We are here at the Black Fire Brigade to support him and his family to make sure that his wife and kids are taken care of and uh, just to support him.